Hello and welcome everybody. This is Adam from Bitru here today. And today we are having a chat with Misha Lederman from the Clever team. Good afternoon, Misha. How are you today? Good afternoon, Adam. I'm great. How are you? I am great as well. And as some people have already seen, we have a new listing coming to Bitru later this week with Clever KLV. And so yesterday we invited our community to ask questions to the Clever team. We've collected a handful of the best ones, which we're going to put to Misha in a moment. But first, I think it would be a good idea if we could both introduce our companies for anyone that doesn't know about them. So Misha, could you first go ahead and introduce Clever for us? My pleasure. Uh, so Clever is a fourth generation crypto wallet ecosystem uh, with uh, two, two apps, uh, Tron Wallet and uh, Clever App, uh, which is the new Evolve Tron Wallet, total uh, 1.6 million users uh, around the world. And the Clever app itself allows users to securely store, receive, send, swap, buy crypto with fiat, uh, buy travels with fiat through a partnership with Travala, um, trade through uh, numerous uh, different trading rooms, as well as uh, use our built-in browser for Web 3.0 access. So that's the app itself. But Clever as a company uh, is a global company, um, about four years old, and uh, has more than 40 developers around the world. Uh, currently, we just added two yesterday, and our uh, goal in 2021 is to have 100 developers, because as you will learn throughout this AMA, uh, the Clever app is uh, just the foundation of what we're doing, and we're building quite a lot of products uh, coming out in the coming months. All right, that's fantastic. Uh, so for anyone who doesn't know about Bitru, uh, we started out as a cryptocurrency exchange, but nowadays we like to refer to ourselves as a digital asset management platform. Uh, so what that means is that we have significantly expanded the services that we offer to our users beyond just trading. A couple of years back, we pioneered the investment model for cryptocurrencies, which is now popular on almost all exchanges. We called this uh, Power Piggy and it's still running today with support for more than 27 different currencies. And aside from that, we also have some other financial management services now available. For example, we have a loan service where you can borrow cryptocurrencies and next week we will be launching our new yield farming service, which we're really excited about. It works very similarly to investments, but it will allow our users to take part in the DeFi yield farming activities that have been really popular over the last few months. And it's going to mean that we become a hybrid CeFi DeFi service. So we're really excited about that coming next week. Okay, so like I mentioned earlier, we have some questions for Misha that came in from our community overnight. So Misha, if you're ready, we can dive right in. Perfect. I'm always ready. Let's go. So number one, why did you decide to list your coin on Bitru? Uh, well, first and foremost, uh, I have uh, a long-standing uh, relationship and friendship with your CEO, Curious Wang, uh, who I uh, find is to be one of the guys in crypto that uh, truly is pushing adoption, uh, someone that I personally and many others really trust on his word. Uh, second, uh, the KLV coin, uh, the, the KLV token that we're listing is uh, already staked at 73%. So 73% of all KLV is currently staked inside Clever App. And as we're adding more features and more chains to the wallet, Binance chain last week, three weeks ago, uh, Litecoin, Digibyte, um, uh, Doge, Dash, um, uh, we're also adding something next week, which is uh, in our next update, we're adding XRP. And by adding a Ripple blockchain into Clever App, uh, we're expanding, of course, the KLV use case because KLV use case uh, is not just for staking uh, at 16 or now 12% APR, uh, it's also to reduce swap fees and, as we're, and, and pay for swap fees as well. And as we're adding more chains, uh, and more coins like XRP, uh, we're also adding these swap pairs. So KLV token becomes even more used and constantly in circulation. 
what we find fascinating about BitTrue, of course, is that you're an XRP-centric exchange, one of the few out there that uh, truly um, try to focus a lot of your effort and your trading on the XRP community and the XRP training community and the XRP army, as, they, as they're called on, on crypto Twitter, I guess. Um, you have a great reputation, very high security, and this power piggy uh, kind of staking that you're doing is something that uh, I think you were very early on uh, in terms of crypto uh, sphere. And it's something that uh, we are really excited about as well, that you're doing a, a similar uh, kind of lockup of KLV as one of the events for the listing where uh, your users will be able to invest KLV for 30 days and get 12% APR back um, through a little power piggy uh, kind of scenario. So uh, those are the reasons we, we're listing KLV on Bitru and we're super excited to, to join a partnership with you to, to, to just, you know, this is just scratching the surface and an XRP and BTC pair is the beginning, but more to come. Yeah, we're really glad to hear that you're adding XRP, uh, you know, you're adding the XRP chain because anyone who's a friend of XRP is a friend of Bitru. Uh, at Bitru, we're also, by the way, we are supporting the Flare airdrop coming up very soon. Uh, so if your XRP is stored on Bitru, you will receive the Spark tokens coming from Flare Networks uh, starting in December. Okay, so let's move on to the next question. On your roadmap, there is mention of a clever browser. Uh, can you talk more about what this product is and what specifically made Clever want to pursue the creation of this product? For sure. Um, in our opinion, uh, the blockchain browsers that are out there are really not up to the standards of what I see as Safari, Chrome, and other absolutely high quality, top notch browsers, web browsers, that is. Uh, Brave uh, has done uh, a good job on some aspects, but in terms of speed and user experience, in my opinion, uh, they're really not up to up to date. And for a blockchain browser, in our case, then Clever Browser, to become uh, a, a massive competitor, you have to understand the big picture of the Clever ecosystem. So inside the Clever Browser, uh, we're not just aiming to change the game for web 3.0 browsers, but all products on Clever are interconnected, which means that we're building an ecosystem that entails uh, the Clever Exchange that has uh, a private beta launched in uh, December this year, um, Clever Blockchain that will have its testnet in February 2021, uh, DeFi products through all future products, essentially, uh, using a lot of liquidity pools and rewards for people to actually put their their coins and tokens up for for grabs, but through a much more secure and trusted way than than the current DeFi space. But we'll come to that later. Um, the clever browser will will be able to interconnect instantly with all the chains that clever already is supporting as and as we're adding. So the the browser experience should not be uh, kind of removed in the sense of hi, how do I feel as I'm, I'm browsing the internet, but how do I also connect to my wallets? How do I trade? How do I buy things with crypto? How do I go from crypto to stablecoin to stablecoin to fiat in a very seamless manner? Clever Browser is there to solve that problem for users worldwide and introduce extremely useful, simple one-click wonders on how to use their crypto in daily life. So that's one of the, in my opinion, one of the, the products that, that I'm most excited about. Uh, and uh, it's currently in production on the Clever Labs, and along with several other products, but we'll get to that in a bit. Okay, that sounds fantastic, very useful. Uh, so this next question I think is very interesting. Uh, at BitTrue lately, we've been quite focused on a lot of uh, TRX-based projects, Tron projects. Uh, so we've listed uh, Sun and Just Tokens and uh, TRC20 uh, USDT as well. Now, Clever, I believe you actually started as a, uh, as a TRX token. So can you talk a little bit about why you chose to use that as a foundation for Clever? Sure. Um, in order to understand that, you have to understand the evolution of 
of Clever. Uh, Clever is a fourth generation crypto wallet. So it's already been in development for over four years. Uh, for the first three years, it was under the name of Tron Wallet, and it was built originally on the Tron blockchain due to its high performance speed. Uh, it's very easy to deploy, and it's, it was at the time a very budding, growing community. Um, as we added Bitcoin last year, as we added ERC20 and all Ethereum tokens last year, we realized that the scope uh, of Tron is... Uh, for us too small and we need a much, much larger platform in order to uh, provide what we uh, see as the two kind of solutions to the two major problems in crypto, which is the security problem and the user experience problem. Uh, some products in, in crypto are great at security and some are better at user experience, but we don't really see one platform that kind of encompasses all. And that's why Clever exists. Um, so once we launched Clever.io, uh, and we um, started adding now in total uh, to eight chains and nine chains with XRP next week. And we're just going to continue adding because what we built over these four years is Clever OS, which is the entire foundation of the Clever ecosystem. So Clever OS is the Clever operating system that uh, provides three main features. One, a very, very strong added layer of security for all mobile users of Clever. Um, also means that our developers can very easily and quickly add chains, uh, which under previous conditions were much harder and took months, and now it takes days, even, you know, tops weeks to do that. Uh, and third, what, what's super interesting about Clever OS is that it actually will serve as an SDK, um, a software development kit for developers worldwide to just plug in their a new crypto wallet into their app, into their wearables, into their web uh, sites, into any um, kind of uh, non-blockchain or blockchain-based uh, application that need a crypto element or a stablecoin element or a fiat to crypto element. They can literally just plug in the, the Clever OS and there they have the Clever wallet. Uh, so in terms of evolution, 2021 February, we will be launching our testnet for the Clever blockchain. And that will be a game changer for the entire ecosystem because KLV token will not only be the main driver, but the Clever blockchain is, is built uh, in a different way than most uh, DAP supporting blockchains today. Uh, essentially, what we've done is to, with the Clever blockchain, uh, is to simplify blockchain app building through through what we're building. Uh, we're actually going to remove the smart contracts completely from the Clever blockchain. And many who I've been speaking to, uh, they're like, well, why are you removing smart contracts? They're, they're so smart. They're really not. They're actually the, the biggest uh, vulnerability and insecurity, in my opinion, to... Uh, dApps today, uh, as you've seen over the past years, most of the intrusions and most of the attacks that have been on the EOS blockchain and other blockchains that use dApps have not been on the blockchain themselves. They're essentially unhackable, but it's been on the smart contracts because smart contracts uh, needs to be built and coded by developers. And if unless they have very high skills in terms of cybersecurity and security, uh, they're very vulnerable and susceptible to attacks. So what we're gonna do is that all the smart contracts triggers and features, instead of letting developers of DApps build that, we're gonna build that. Which means that all the triggers for staking, a feature of vesting, a token that needs a feature of automation or automated uh, market maker like Uniswap, automated loans on the blockchain, swaps between tokens, all of those features that are in dApps today will be a built-in feature into the Clever blockchain, which removes the insecure um, element of smart contracts while upping security and usability and means that anyone, whether you have a developer has, has experience in building a blockchain app or an app in, in general uh, related to crypto, anyone can build 
adapt on the Clever blockchain. Wow, that's fascinating. It shows, uh, I think, a really great ambition there. Um, so one of the, the major buzzwords of 2020, certainly of the last uh, six months or so, has been DeFi. Uh, I'm sure nobody in the crypto space has been able to escape its influence. So for you at the Clever team, has the hype of DeFi influenced your plans? In simple terms? Yes, DeFi has influenced our plans uh, in, in a very positive and uh, I think innovative way. I can't reveal too much right now exactly what we're building in terms of DeFi, uh, but for me um, and for the Clever team, the DeFi essentially stands, of course, for decentralized finance, but it stands for something much, much more, which is in the empowerment of the individual to be able to automate a swap or a loan or any kind of uh, authentication. Um, and DeFi itself also, of course, gives the user and, and, and organizations worldwide the ability to earn by staking their coins or putting into liquidity pools. The DeFi element will be uh, integrated into not just the Clever blockchain, but also the uh, Clever exchange as well as all other products that we're building. I, I can't unfortunately go into exactly how it's going to work because we have some announcements and some reveals coming up, uh, which means that uh, my, my team would be uh, quite sour at me if I, if I reveal those now today. But all I can say is that, that DeFi uh, on Clever and, and the Clever blockchain will have a much uh, more direct, simpler, in terms of user experience and a more trusted environment. Unfortunately, today we see a lot of uh, coins and tokens being created um, where, where people are losing millions of dollars because they're, they have no idea who's behind it and, and, and how it works. Uh, in my opinion, uh, the you know no need for trust, but you need to verify. In my opinion, you do need trust as we move over from the fiat world to crypto, everything cannot just suddenly go and be 100% decentralized. That's not how the world works. And I think Sushi, Swap, and Yam, and every other uh, food token have proven that, that there has to be some form of element of trust to, uh, uh, to a team or a blockchain as the basis for DeFi. And, and that's what we're gonna provide. Okay, so you mentioned uh, that you have some announcements and reveals coming up very soon. So the, the number one question that we received is, what are the upcoming features and what's the roadmap uh, for the Clever team in the near future? Excellent question. So um, first of all, I'm super happy to hear that uh, that was the most asked question because that's what we're all about building. Um, I've worked uh, in uh, cybersecurity and in uh, the crypto space for, for many years. I have never worked with a team like the Clever IO team. Uh, from CEO level to literally every back end, front end developer, uh, designer, UI UX specialist, everyone is an expert in their field, pushing the, you know, passionately pushing. Uh, innovation to a new level and I'm super happy and stoked to share some of our plans. Uh, like I said, we're a growing team uh, of roughly 20 to begin of the year. We're currently 40 developers, um, just developers. Uh, and 100 developers we're going to be, or over 100 in 2021. So uh, very aggressively uh, expanding team. Uh, in a few weeks, we'll be launching uh, our new product, Clever News, inside of Clever, which is um, a meeting place of aggregated news, AI-driven for the user, whether they like XRP, BTC, blockchain, crypto uh, in general, or they have a specific, you know, whether they are into KLV or TRX, ETH, they will have very, very personalized news directly in the app. Second, there will be uh, community-based uh, and driven content. We also made a partnership with Gokstein Media. We're also having numerous partnerships come up, coming up with, um, with media houses and uh, 
trading houses that we're going to provide blockchain data, news, uh, community content, of course, original content, that essentially means that you don't have to leave the app. You just do everything inside the app, whether it's to swap, hold, store crypto, go into the browser, buy crypto, or buy anything of uh, that's out for, for uh, services of, of Clever or through our partners. But now you also, you don't have to go and get your, your, uh, your blockchain news or your crypto news elsewhere. Everything will be delivered to you inside the app through Clever News. So we're super excited about that. Uh, next product after that, we'll go in a private beta in December 2020. So uh, around two months uh, or so from now, uh, which is the Clever Exchange. And the Clever Exchange is... Uh, primarily a centralized exchange and we've been building it for over a year now already um, and it will be released first inside the mobile app inside the clever app uh, and then a web based version uh, all features that any high quality exchange has uh, in addition to features that we've constantly uh, over the past year and a half uh, consumed from our users on what do they love about exchanges today? What don't they love? What is important to them? How do we cater that uh, through our very strong relationship with our user base? Um, we are going to field uh, an exchange that, that people are, are definitely going to love and use on a daily basis. Um, thirdly, of course, is, is what, what's going to be the basis of everything we do which is the Clever blockchain. And the Clever blockchain, beyond simplifying the app building, it's also going to be, um, I would say, a house for stable coins, for crypto stable coins, for fiat stable coins. It will be a house for a lot of innovation, a lot of AI-driven uh, blockchain um, elements that takes community building and, and blockchain, uh, I would say the, the possibilities of what blockchain can do and should do uh, to the masses. Because currently today, the, the, the technicalities of the blockchain space, I think keeps a lot of, uh, not a lot of, hundreds of millions, if not billions of people away from it because they don't understand how to build. What, how do they benefit from this? What, what is that reclaiming of financial freedom that Clever and so many other crypto companies are talking about? So, so the, the, the Clever blockchain will not only migrate KLV and all our stable coins and our, our future fiat stable coins, uh, including the, the Brazilian real that we're soon launching, uh, but it, it will be, like I said prior, a simplified house of development for all developers out there who want to build a crypto elemented or blockchain uh, elemented uh, app. So those are the, the, the three uh, main ones. And of course, like I mentioned prior, uh, we're building the Clever Browser that will encompass the entire thing. So the big picture is essentially that the Clever app is just a taste of what we're building. Uh, Clever app will serve, of course, as, as the main driver of what we do. And the KLV token is the main token of all these platforms. So the, the use case today in terms of staking, paying transaction fees, paying uh, and reducing swap fees will be expanded each month uh, through, through these new platforms. So uh, we have a lot to build. We're building 24-7 uh, with our global team. And we're super happy to partner up with, with, uh, with organizations like Bitru uh, to reach a, a bigger audience and to, to raise awareness of what we do and why we do it. That's fantastic. Well, that's all of the questions that we have today. Uh, Misha, I love uh, your ambition. Uh, I think your company is, is growing really well. And, um, yeah, I think it's something that everyone is going to be watching uh, very, very closely throughout the next couple of years. Uh, thank you very much for taking the time to come and talk to us today. Uh, we want to remind everybody that Clever Trading will be going live on the BTC and XRP pairs on Bitru starting on October 29th. And we also have two bonus campaigns happening on that day as well. 
Uh, so first of all, anyone who deposits their KLV on BitTrue during the first week uh, will get a bonus of uh, a share of 1 million KLV that will be proportional to your deposits. Second of all, we also have an investment opportunity where you can invest your KLV in our lockups to get 12% APR over 30 days. So for more information, just check out bitrue.com. Misha, do you have any closing remarks that you would like to share with us? I just want to say, uh, first of all, thank you to the entire uh, Clever community uh, who is out there on a daily basis um, with positivity, uh, with, uh, first of all, you know, it's so global, so it's, it's unbelievable. You know, I, I, I see sometimes the data uh, in terms of like the usage of Clever uh, and not just the growth of it, but literally how, how worldwide it is uh, from you know, Alaska to, to Australia and all things in between, you know, growing markets in developing countries like Nigeria and India and, and Indonesia and Philippines. So I wanted to say thank you from the bottom of my heart for everything that you guys do out there. Uh, and I want to say thank you to, to you, Adam, and, and the people at Bitru for, for working with us and seeing uh, uh, what we do and seeing the potential in what we do. And uh, as our BD always says, you know, we are so, so, so small. Uh, in terms of comparing our little crypto world to the legacy financial world. And only together uh, are we stronger and only together can we, can we truly accomplish what we want to do. There's really, in my opinion, no competition inside uh, of crypto. All we do is to push each other further to make better products, more useful products, and more simple products for everyone to understand, benefit from, and love. So thank you for that. All right. Thank you, Misha. All right. Uh, so we'll be signing off now. I hope you have a good rest of the day and I hope we can speak again soon. Likewise. Goodbye, Adam. Bye-bye.